Now let's go to About Us, who we are. Now if you notice the URL path here, it's currently the Drupal default path. So we need to install Path Auto module to auto generate the URL areas for this purpose. Now let's go to Path Auto module page. As it pointed out here, the Path Auto module automatically generates URL aliases for all kinds of content types, taxonomy terms, and users based on the pattern. A good URL alias is helpful in SEO performance. It's also very helpful when setting the Drupal's block visibility. So let's install the module first. Now for Path Auto, you need to install Token module as well. This means you need to install two modules, Path Auto and Token. Let's scroll down. Copy the link. Back to our site. Go to module. Install new module. Paste the link here. Install. Now install another module. Let's go to token module page. Scroll down. Copy the link. Back to our site here. Paste. Install. Enable the modules. Now you will notice the interface of my module page has already changed. That's because I have installed module filter to make the find and search easier. You can pause the video and install this module. Now let's go to module filter page. After installing this module, let's go back to our Drupal site. From here you can easily filter the list. Let's type path auto. Turn it on. Search the next token. Scroll down. Save the configuration. Let's go to the configuration page. Configuration. Search in metadata. URL aliases. This is the listing page for all the aliases, but currently it's empty because there's no aliases generated by the module yet. We'll do it after this. Now there are a few new tabs added here to provide more functions than the configurations. Patterns, settings, and the other tool. Let's go to patterns. Here you can configure the pattern where you want your path to be generated. We will update the default pattern. Let's highlight this content, remove it and replace it with content type pattern instead. So click on the replacement pattern down here, go to notes, scroll down. This is the content type. We need this token. Click on the token, scroll up, it will automatically fill it. Now pattern for all basic page paths, we often use menu links pattern so that it will join all the parents of the menu links into the path. So let's find the pattern and fill it. Click on Replacement Patterns, Notes, scroll down, Menu Link, Parents, scroll down, Join Path. So we need this token. Let's click on this token, scroll up, it should fill it up for us. Let's put a slash here and fill it with Note Title. Scroll down, look for note title, close this one. This is the note title, let's click on it, scroll up. So we'll use this pattern. Let's scroll down and save the configuration. Okay, now everything is ready. Let's perform a bulk update. Click on bulk update, select everything and click update. Back to our list. Now the new areas is generated. Let's go to the front page. Click on about us, who we are. Now we have a beautiful URL areas. Path Auto is a great module, especially when you are working on a multi-level taxonomy or term reference view. All right. Let's proceed to the next.